And good morning. Today, meet an entire family whose life revolves around goats. We're not kidding. It's a great First up this morning, though, we weren't sure we'd have room for all of our next <laughs> guests here on the yellow couch. Maybe you've seen this family of 10 before. They were on The Doctors, The Today Show, in Oprah Magazine. Today, we invited them all to join us to talk about their hobby, which has turned into a thriving family business. Mm -hmm. PJ and Jim Jonas have eight kids. They're all homeschooled and ranged from ages 7 to 18 and get this their names are in alphabetical order they all work for the family business on their indiana farm so we're gonna wave when we say your name okay well, i think we're starting we've over got there, brett right? No. oh right here okay. we're starting with the oldest brett, brett coulter emery fletcher graydon hewitt indigo and jade i love those names so you oh. had let's see one two three four five boys in a row I right? did, yes, and my oldest daughter cried about the last four. <laughs> I thought you were like, when are we going to get a girl and a little more estrogen in the house, yeah. right? Did you exactly. have more children just to give her a daughter? Yeah, no, a that sister. really sister, wasn't, yeah. wasn't the plan. It was really just one at a time. <laughs> <laughs> so great. It's so great to have all of you here. Let's just start with, you, you've got this Indiana farm. Mm -hmm. Did you ever think that what you did on the farm would become a thriving family business? I had no idea it was going to become what it's become. I had prayed for years for something that our family could do together because we homeschool. I wanted their education to be really practical, so I wanted them to learn business skills and how to market and how to do sales and things like that. But I had no idea it would grow to become something that we're shipping stuff worldwide. Yeah. I, I think it's insane. How did you come up with the idea of it being goat milk based? Well, I had gotten the dairy goats because I wanted the raw milk for the children, and mm -hmm. so I wanted things that were healthy for them. And then I had them in the bathtub one day, and I was just letting them splash around, and I picked up the baby wash that I had always used and for the first time I ever looked at the ingredient list and I was just really upset that it was filled with all these chemicals and petroleum based mm -hmm. chemicals and so I decided that I was gonna make my own soap and when you make soap you need to use a liquid and most soap that you get at the store is just made with water but I had the goat milk and so I knew it was good to drink and you, know, you hear those stories about Cleopatra used to take a milk bath uh -huh. so I decided instead of water I was gonna put the goat milk in and then when I put it in after I had the soap made and put it in the shower my husband's fingers stopped cracking and splitting really? Really? Is this yeah. a true story? Oh yeah, it made a huge, huge difference. I was working outside all the time, and my, they would crack and split. And uh, we started using the soap, and I didn't need lotion anymore or anything. And it's not mm. just soap. The soap smells unbelievable. Yeah. Thank you so much for sending us some a little bit in, in advance because I put one bar in like my underwear sock drawer, and everything <laughs> smells fantastic. Um, but Tiff loves because you have like the lotion um, and a, a stick. stick and a chapstick this right here too. You're looking at yeah. this is your lotion stick. Yeah, we started. We started with the bar soap, that was the first product, and Very we good. have it in a lot of different scents as you mentioned, but we also have it unscented because I didn't realize, because my kids don't have it, but there are so many kids with eczema and adults with eczema yeah. out there that they struggle really finding something, so we have the unscented for them as well. And then all the other products just kind of started out whether we needed it or people would ask me to make it. And as you said, the, the lotion stick is really nice because you can just put it in your pocket and keep it with you and just put it where you need it. So It's super easy. I was, I was teasing her because I, I had gotten a tattoo now long ago and you have to keep it uh, yep. with lotion on it and honest to God I was like you need to sell that at tattoo shops yeah, because it's like <laughs> the easiest thing ever to keep it moisturized and we have it in the tea tree which is what we recommend for stuff like that there because that's anti naturally antibacterial so which that really awesome. helps you mm -hmm. already know what you're doing so yeah. okay break down some of the tasks that the yeah, kids that's do that's what I was going to ask too I'm going to hand you the microphone too and if you send it that way because one of the things we've read about you guys is that you do a little bit of everything from office work to even milking the goats so go down the line and tell us what you do do to help out the family business? Just kind of in a sentence. Yeah. Um, I work on our computers. I do things like run our blog and print off orders, and so I just do a bunch of random computer tasks for the business. And you're the office? I'm 18. Okay. You're 18. Are you, are you, how, how old are you in school then? Would you be a senior? I'm actually taking college classes at our local community college right now. Of Great. course you are. That's awesome. <laughs> okay, next. I make the soap. It's my job to work in there. I do everything from getting all the ingredients ready to mixing it all in the pot and then sending it out the door for the boys to unmold the next day. That and you're how old? Awesome. I'm 16. Okay. And I'm also taking college classes. Of course. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Um, I work in the barn a lot, and then I'm working on our new food products. Good for you. Oh, you're doing food products, too. We're building a, a certified kitchen right now so that we'll be able to offer the food products. We do. We eat so much goat cheese and goat milk caramel and fudge, yeah. which is his specialty. <gasps> oh, so yeah. once we have the certified kitchen, then we can legally ship that out as well. All okay. right, I need and to get how your old? email after yeah. the show. Yeah. <laughs> and you're how old? I'm 14. 14. 14. Okay. Okay. 
I help make uh, the soap. Um, Coulter's teaching me how to do that, and I'm pretty much just helping to do that. That way, when he does not have time to do stuff, or if he has to do stuff, I can just pitch you in there and help. How old are you? I'm 13. You're 13. Okay. You look great in your suit, by the way. Yeah, all <laughs> of you. You're welcome. Um, I'm really the barn manager. No I do way. everything. How old are you? Uh, 12. You're the barn manager? Pretty much. You manage the animals? Yes. Do you tell the goats what to do, too? Um, not really, but oh, okay. I they, understand them a lot. All right. You do? Yeah. Okay, so as the barn manager, what, what do you do, then? Everything. Get the goats <laughs> feed, milk them, feed the babies. It's cleaning the muck stalls. Are these the babies? Yes. Do, that's do, you, them. do you have names for them? Or yes, every, every who, one. Who of gets them. to name? Are they in alphabetical order like you guys are? <laughs> no. No. Who gets to name them? Uh, Mom. She Your has mom veto does. power. But we all get to um, shout out random ones. You, you get a little say in the, the yeah. deal. And you're okay. how old? 12. You're 12. All oh right. my gosh. Next. Okay. I like the bow tie, by the way. You're I... pulling that off. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, mold the soap and cut it. I put it on the trays, and then I just do whatever everyone else needs. You cut it? Do you cut it with a like a sharp tool? or? Well, we actually just use guitar strings. Oh, guitar strings. Mm -hmm. How old are you? 10. You're 10. All right. Are you in fourth grade? Would that um, be your, your home school, but I have no clue. <laughs> okay, okay. Neither do I. Okay. That's cool. Okay. I uh, help people in the retail room and make sure that they get the stuff they need. Okay, so you're sort of like customer service. Yeah. Okay, and how old are you? I'm nine. You're nine. You're cute too. Love it. I do all the buying. <laughs> you do the buying? Yep. Bagging. Oh, bagging. the bagging. The soap. What do you get to bag? All the soap. Yep, all the soap. I also help cap the lotions. No, I think the soap smells incredible. Do you mm -hmm. think so too, or do you get kind of sick of it after a while? Um, I don't really smell them all together that much because I'm kind of used to the smell, so it's I don't really smell them. <laughs> and who milks the goats? Oh, the oh one two one <laughs> two three. Oh, so four of you milk the goats. Okay, uh, who that's awesome. Who makes the best goat sound? Anyone? Go ahead. Let's hear it. Well, we got to have the mic down. Let's hear it. Go ahead. We got to hear it. I got to hear the goat sound. All right, you get to do yeah, one too. You get to do one too. Okay, this is baby goat. <laughs> we used to have two goats growing up, and it was Katie and Katie did, and um, we loved it. But we did not make a business out of it. You guys are amazing. Yeah. You, oh, do you want to do a sound too? No, she just wants to hold the mic. Okay. Well, you ship your soap to every state in, mm -hmm. in America, correct? We do. We ship it all over the United States, and we also ship it um, worldwide. We'll do a lot of different countries, um, particularly like Australia and Singapore, things like that. Um, one of the things for our homeschooling education that was very neat was we actually shipped soap to Antarctica once. There's a research station oh, there, and so we got an order cool. from Antarctica, so we say we've been on all seven continents. There well, you and go. I've seen your family bus, because you yes. drive a vehicle that fits everybody. And just real quick, Dad, do you work outside the home as well, or do you... No, I barely work inside the home. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. There's the, there's the bus. Oh, this is the bus. There yeah. we go. That is hilarious. We that's call that fantastic. the beast. That's the what beast. we refer to that as. That is the beast. That's and that's fantastic. People can find your stuff at the, the, the website that you saw on the bus. We're going to put it up again. It's um, goatmilkstuff.com. They can get all that stuff. What's your favorite? If you said, you know, just try one thing, try this. The oatmeal milk and honey soap is our favorite soap that's and the most popular. Popular. Yeah. I love it. It I was so it. great to have you guys here. Thank you so much for making the trip, for joining us. We loved it. Yeah, appreciate it. You Thank guys you are pretty so cool. Thank you so much. You're awesome. Work hard. Get dirty. Use good soap. GoatMilkStuff.com <laughs> Don't forget, subscribe today.